Hey, what's up guys, aloha, happy Sunday. So today's video is gonna be about work boots, what I like, what I look for in a boot. So let's go. All right, so my favorite boot that I've been using for the past four years, well, this boot is, um, I wanna say about maybe a year old. They only last me about a year because I put them to work. So this one started to separate. That's usually the first thing that go on these on this this style of boot from Red Wings this separates there's a hole over there or here where the crease is that and then sometimes it starts to separate there but even though there's separations here and there I could technically still use these but since the bottom is all worn out and I just I, I just rather toss them and then break in the new ones so I was lucky enough to find uh, a couple of these in the Red Wings in California on sale. Regular price, I think they're like two, two hundred and sixty. But I got them for like one, one sixty. So I bought a couple of the same boot to replace uh, my daily, daily shoes. But yeah, these are super comfortable. They're waterproof and they're fairly lightweight for them being a steel toe. So that's what I look for in a boot. Also. What I really enjoy about them is that they're super easy to take on and off. This kind of just stays as is, so I just undo this and then all I do is hook it back to the hook when I'm putting it back on. So I only have to pretty much tie my shoelace once. They stay like that and I can fit my foot in here easily without having to undo my shoelaces. So that's, that's what I like. And if I need to take them on and off, like when I'm doing pickup work, all I do is I wrap my shoelace like that and I'll wear them like that. I'll just, you, your foot can go in good. And like I said, they're pretty comfortable. These are, are my favorites. Um, I like to put insoles mainly because it helps with my lower back pain and heels. You know, this is the ones I bought off of um, online. They're pretty good. I've been using them for about nine months now. Can't complain and you see that hole right there i didn't notice it but apparently there's a freaking screw on my heel i don't know for how long but you can kind of see let's see if we can see it you see that You see that screw head right there? That tetanus waiting to happen? <laughs> yeah, so thankfully it stopped it because there's no penetration on this end. So I would have never felt it. But it would have definitely hit my foot if I didn't have that insole in there. But uh, yeah, so these are going to be the ones I, I'm going to change out the insole. I have bought in, if you're a Red Wings guy like me, these are about 80 bucks at Red Wings, but honestly, if I'm gonna compare these to the ones that I bought specifically designed for your foot, like these right here, these are way better. They're a little bit more expensive, but they feel way more comfortable than the $80 inflated insoles that Red Wings sells. Um, but yeah, I'm also gonna be wearing these for my takeoffs. I just bought these. I used to, I used to wear a lot of Wolverine, but the quality, the quality as far as uh, how long they last, kind of took a dip in the last couple years. So I, I traded over to Red Wings. But these ones, I saw the advertisement, the dual, the Wolverine, they're the Dura Shocks. So this is their new boot. It's it's uh, I like the style. This is one of my favorite styles as far as casual work boots go. The bottom feels really like soft and cushiony so it's not like the regular super thick heavy rubberized bottom so we'll see how I've, I've worn them a couple days fairly comfortable so um yeah what kind of work boots do you guys like what do you recommend as far as insoles go and all of that anyways have you having a good day and uh comment below share what your favorite boot and your your insole okay aloha